you've perfected the art of um, the white woman tears to show emotion to Ghana empathy. You were traumatized. Oh my Jesus, I'm so sorry. Chama, you showed bravery on Saturday. And I'm glad you're alive. No, I don't want you. You have beautiful, two beautiful kids to raise. You will be alive to raise them. I don't wish you that. I called out your bullshit. And cry me a river from now to tomorrow. I still stand by what I wrote on Saturday. So you could fear for your life this much. You could call for people to come rescue you that you were under duress, you were in danger. But four years ago, you had the temerity to tell me not to post about those people. Is it because they have no name? They are not actors? They don't have the voice? And why should we use our platform to, to highlight their problem? My darling Chioma, I don't think me, Georgina, has ever slided into your DM one day to tell you what to do or what to post. Most often when I see the shenanigans you post, I turn my second eye and I go, it's your right, it's your life. If you felt what I was posting four years ago was messing with your well, mental well-being, you could have just switched off, turn off social media and leave because it was not you. It was not affecting you directly. It was affecting other people. So because they were not stars, they were not worthy, to be brought to light that they were being killed in rivers, you know, caught in a, oh, your polling place was safe. On Saturday, there were polling places that were safe. So what were you doing Adi, after you voted? Why didn't you go home? That wouldn't have happened to you. Okay, so you want to be the DJ switch so that when Obi becomes president, the ballot, Choma fought and rescued, made Obi president and said, bullshit, Choma. You're full of shit. Well, full people who just got to know you today, yesterday, or they know your social media handle and they don't know the real you. You're a grifter. You're very super salacious. If there's no gain there, you don't care. When I wrote what I wrote, I said, we have 18 years of friendship. Oh, by the way, you said I replicated your wedding, your whatever. And, and darling, don't bring family into this. So <laughs> you know, go win. You know, go in. That you took me to maybe where you bought your wedding can and said bog can and the only bog can they had was the same thing you had that I bought. Does not mean it was replicated. Choma, who gave you money if you should buy your wedding can? Or you took me to where they were pre Yeah, your wedding was a So I am begging you in the name of God, leave family matter out of this so you know go like can. I still stand on what I said on Saturday. Choma, you're a very selfish and self-centered person. If it does not suit or serve your purpose, you turn a blind eye. Why should Nigeria care about what happened to you on Saturday? Oh, I see, because you're an actor. You have a name, you have a face. So we should all be scared. Oh, Choma was being... I'm glad nothing happened to you. I still love you as a sister, but I detest your character of greed. You're a user. You don't give a shit about nobody if it doesn't favor you. I can see you and all your goons. I'm proud of you. Now. So because you cut and paid two months, senior me, see your older time. If I slap you, the, uh, your eye go clear. You didn't mind. I still remain. Choma, four years ago was more, election, election four years ago was more deadlier than what happened on Saturday. Those people that got killed, their life mattered. Somebody needed to advocate and speak up for them. But you and your goons, you turn a blind eye, you sit on the fence because you want to protect brand. Thank your star that Instagram, my account was hacked. When I show Nigerians the real receipt, they will know what a deadbeat human being you are. You're all about the money, you're all about brand, and you're all about grift. You're a grifter. You don't care for nobody. You're only now you've had a taste of what they had four years. I hope next time, anywhere you see injustice, you will speak up and speak out. Don't only speak out because they are actors or they are famous or they are a brand name. Speak out. Injustice anywhere is injustice everywhere. You lack integrity. You lack, you, you lack moral compass. You're shouting so you want to pull a DJ switch so you save will be presidency by fighting for that. I'm glad that they don't break your head because your children they need you. You and your minachos. I'm glad it's not a, because you don't cut and paste our conversation. I'm glad you it takes so much for someone to curse you out. That is how unscrupulous.